this whole COVID thing, eh? a lot of us have lost a couple of relatives. Eh? Mm-hmm. But then for me, it wasn't just relatives, because this is what happened. Kumambio, what was it? Kumambio, when we were here, just a little COVID break. Since the message, Kunawati, our bishop has passed. And honestly, for me, it was a shock. I didn't expect that. Then, in a, in a week's time, like the same week, we see news, Kunawati, the wife has also passed. Hey, hey, it wasn't easy. Like, honestly, honestly, it wasn't. Because, okay, two minutes in a I can tell you, Kunawati, I've managed to get over it, but then, Saying that woman's a carabin to cancer when I was here. When I mean, when I go home, mean as I'm take, he might show up and give us one more teaching. Like, when I might go back home and one day the wife would be there, like, to welcome me home. Like, something like that. It was that crazy. So, that is fun of it. So, you can imagine how things were. But then, honestly, I didn't go out because I had friends. I really had friends a lot around, and it felt like family. And too many scenarios, the presence of friends would make you feel the presence of God, like they make it tangible sometimes. I don't know how, but then they do. When I was with your friends around, you still believe I think God is still with us. You get it right? Mm-hmm. So I wrote a piece for them. And uh, I titled it, Friends Like You. It's based on that experience that I had. So it's really personal. Amen. Amen. So it goes like this. Friends like you. And the good thing about you, case, I think you'll be the first audience this time. Because I dropped it on the 16th this month. So it's like a tweet to go somewhere there. So you guys are the first audience. Amen. Amen. Friends like you. The reason I have a smile on my worst days the light shining ever brighter on my dark days. The happy melodies playing continuously on my somber days. The hearts I continuously love on my most hated days. Binoculars I can always use to see light at the end of this terribly dark tunnel. Smiles that give me more than a million reasons to smile. Faces shining bright, giving mine a hundred reasons to light up in style. Songs of praise that give me more than a dozen reasons to be grateful time after time. Hearts that give mine a reason to beat one more time. The fear I've been burning and will keep burning till I make it out of this dark tunnel. Tongues speaking life to my date situation. Noses breathing life into the nostrils of this date nation. Eyes facing the hassle of continuously lifting up this downcast soul. Ears listening to all the painful groans of this fainted heart. Skins feeling the depth of the pain being felt by this bruised mortal. Taking it all to heart. Friends like you, bro. Friends like you, sis. Friends like you, genius. Friends like you, man. The almighty you. And yet friends like you, dear. Telling me you care because you really do. Telling me you love me, then showing me you really do. Trying so hard to be there for me because you say you would. Wishing you would somehow do more for me if only you could. Sharing your small umbrella with me on my rainy days. Friends I know I can trust. Hearts that I know care for me. Minds that often think of me. Knees that refuse to leave the ground. Heads that bow down and talk to God on my behalf year round. Friends I know I can always count on. Shoulders I can always lean on. Hands I know will always hold me tight. Arms ready to embrace. Warming the coldest of souls. Backs strong enough to carry me to the hilltop. A place where like an eagle my spirit soars. Friends like you dear. Friends like you sis. Friends like you bro. Friends like you man. The only one you, and yet friends like you, genius. Walk into class and quickly check if I'm in. Walk out of class and call me when you realize I'm not in. You never get tired of updating me on all the materials I've missed. Always enjoying giving me a hand, catching up with my schoolwork, taking pleasure in my success. While helping me get over my failures, you hardly take a break. Calling just to check on me, texting simply to know how my day has been, telling me you miss me because you really do. Visiting me even when I stay miles away from your door. Showing me I'm like a David to you. Like Jonathan, loving me as your own soul. Can't imagine what life would have been like. What it would have been like without friends I like. Friends I like keeping around because they've decided to stay. 
friends who take pleasure in being a blessing and giving more than they gauge, sparing their most precious resources, their time to cheer a heavy heart. Friends like you, man. Friends like you, genius. Friends like you, bro. Friends like you, sis. Friends like you, fam. God knows I'm internally grateful for friends like you. Amen. Amen. So yeah, that's that paragraph. You know, you're talking about some of my classmates, cause. At two in Sinagri, you just feel like, on the way in class, you like, you have a lot on your mind already. So, in the online classes, I just, it's not as well as you can do still take the time, but it's the same attendance, I just, so go there and check. If I'm not there, they'll text me, or even call me, or send me the link to the class, as of well. now, really, I didn't get online to get the link. So, yeah, that's the reason why, like, get into class and check it from there. If I'm not there, then you walk out of class, then call me just to make sure when you came in class. Always updating me on all the materials of me and stuff. So, yeah, friends like you. Amen. <laughs> I hope someone will tag you, day night, and say that I would be great for friends like you. Or well, who knows, me and night, you might just get on, on your status and be like, tag someone and say friends like you. Let them know what you appreciate them. Amen.